What up, YouTube? It is your boy, All About The Sneakers, back with another unboxing and review video for you guys. Now, today, we will be unboxing the... Hmm. I don't know what we'll be unboxing. Now, you guys may know from that thumbnail, but unfortunately, I do not because this is a mysterious package for me. I actually have several of these mysterious packages that have piled up since the safe in place situation that has been going on in the world and even a little bit afterwards i picked up so many different sneakers that i honestly just do not know what is in the boxes so bear with me guys again you should know from that thumbnail so check that out if you haven't already now before we get started if you're new to the channel go ahead and smash the like subscribe and share button and make sure you hit the notification bell so you can stay up to date on future release video now with no further ado let's get right into this mysterious package all right so i got the handy dandy box cutter on deck got the blade out and we'll start by making a cut across the side of the box and let's get this thing open let's put that away and let's get the shoe box out aha we got a Jordan box, guys. I'm a little bit closer to figuring out this mystery package. Okay, so I just read the size sticker briefly just to make sure I knew what I was unboxing. And so guys, I did find out, which you already know, that I'm unboxing the Air Jordan 1 Low Sweater. Okay, so now I'm really, really excited, guys. I have not seen this shoe in person. This was an online pickup, as you know, from the shipping box and so forth. But let's go ahead and get right into it. Okay, again, as you can see, we do have the black Jordan box, standard box with the golden jump man on one side. We have our typical Nike branding on the bottom of the box. And on the other side of the box, we have that golden 23 as well as our size sticker. And the size sticker reads Air Jordan 1 Low SE. The colorway is white, dark obsidian, team red. This is a US size 10 in men's, which is the personal size for me in the Air Jordan. And the suggested retail value is 110 US dollars. Now, before we go any further, I do want to give a big shout out to Bay for copping this sneaker for me. Uh, she has been helping out tremendously. It's really good to have a supporter on your team. If you're in a relationship or even if you're not, you have a roommate, anything like that. It's good to have someone who helps support you because I really do appreciate that. The channel is growing to where it has and hopefully we will advance to more milestones down the line and hopefully quickly but having someone to help out like that really does make a tremendous impact on the channel so i really appreciate that shout out to bay once again all right now let's see what we have under the lid and as you guys can see we do have our typical flip up lid on this standard jordan box we got that off-white tissue paper with the golden 23s all over it and let's go ahead and get the shoe out okay 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 there you have it guys, the Air Jordan 1 Low Sweater. Looking very, very clean, very nice, colorful. In my opinion, one of my favorite pickups this year, uh, especially to be an Air Jordan 1 Low because I've just started recently picking these up in 2020 and I'm really liking this one so far. Now let's go ahead and do a quick 360 on the shoe. All right guys, so far, comment below. Let me know what you guys think about this sneaker just from looking at it off the bat. Uh, if you guys went after this shoe, if you did not, you're not a fan of lows, you only like highs, you like lows and mids, whatever, comment below and let me know. Now let's go ahead and go over the shoe a little in depth. All right guys, as you can see, we do have a black outsole, a white midsole, white leather here on this mid panel. We have a black Nike swoosh. And of course, going around the toe cap, and on up to the accent with the laces as well as the rear here on the heel we do have that sweater look that MJ wore way 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 back in the day he had like a whole little outfit I want to say he has some shorts a sweater maybe even a t-shirt and I know some of the apparel is available out on the internet so I will go and check for some of that apparel now that I have these shoes but I think that sweater look is really, really nice. Gives it a nostalgic 80s look. Okay, so about that Nike swoosh, I did want to get up a little close for you guys just to see that there is some red stitching going around the swoosh. 
Not sure if you can see that, but this is as good as it's going to get, guys. Then also around the ankle here, we do have some black leather. Now just testing the leather quality on here, it is not premium as we know for an Air Jordan 1 Low as well as the mids. They just come with that kind of synthetic leather. I mean, I'm pretty sure a lot of the highs are synthetic as well, but it's like not the greatest quality, but it's not horrible at all, guys. Still feels good. Just not that baby ass soft feeling that we're used to. But that is all I have for the lateral side of the shoe. Moving along, on the medial side of the shoe, we get the exact same look as we got on the lateral side. Nothing different. And on to the front of the shoe, as you can see, we do have that sweater going around the toe cap. White leather here on the toe box. Standard white laces in place. And we get sort of a maroon text here on that lace loop. And it does have that 23 stitched on there again in maroon. And this is a nylon tongue on the shoe. And we also have a maroon stitch jump man there on the top of the tongue. Okay, so let me rephrase that. As I mentioned, in the colorway, it is team red, not maroon. It really looks like maroon, so that's what I'm kind of running with. But it is technically team red. All right, now on to the rear of the shoe. As you can see, that black outsole, white midsole, the sweater texture or pattern, as well as that Team Red Air Jordan wing logo right there in the middle. Looks very nice on the back. Kind of hard to see, but it is there. A little bit of white here showing. We have a black tab there and the black ankle. All right, guys, and moving along to the inside of the shoe, we do have a black sock liner. We also have a white insole with that Team Red Jumpman there in the center. I'll get a little bit close on that. And here we have the cardboard shoe tree. I went ahead and took this out so it would be easier to see inside of the shoe. And on the back of the tongue, we get our sizing tag. All right, moving along to the outsole, we have an all black outsole with that Nike Tex and Swoosh logo right there in the center. Nothing special, but I am glad it's black. The least it is to get dirty. All right, guys, and there you have it, the Air Jordan 1 low sweater. Go ahead and comment below. Let me know what you guys think about this sneaker. Again, if you did or did not go after the shoe, uh, I think it is still available at some stores. You could probably find it online. Now, we ended up catching this one on a restock. So this shoe did restock, which means at some point it did sell out. But it seems like it continues to restock. So if you do want it, go ahead and go cop the shoe while it is available. I want to say I picked this one up at Hibbit Sports. So yeah, Hibbit Sports, I know Finish Line has it um, or had it at one point. Just get out, do your research, go check if you do want to cop this shoe. Not sure how long it will stay in stock. So yeah, do what you got to do to get it. If not, no worries. Let's go ahead and do one more quick 360 on the shoe. All right, and one last look at the shoe before we put it away. All right, guys, and that pretty much wraps up this episode. Thank you guys for watching. As always, we are on our way to that 400 subscriber mark. You guys can help a lot by liking, sharing, subscribing, and hitting the notification bell so you can stay up to date on future release videos. I would appreciate you guys going to do all of those things if you haven't already. But again, that is all I have, guys. Once again, it is your boy, all about the sneakers signing off until the next episode. I will catch you guys later. Salute. I'm out.